Hey everybody, back again with another unboxing. Been looking forward to this release for quite a while now. It is the Best Buy exclusive of Men in Black 3. It is the Steelbook version. Uh, I just want to let everybody know this is not a 3D Blu-ray. This is just a regular Blu-ray. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a DVD in here. Maybe two Blu-ray discs actually. But uh, Let's go ahead and take, take this out of the wrapper. Right there. Let's go ahead and see what features we have right here. Looks like you got the basic features. You know, you got a, a gag reel and the making of. Nothing really special in this right here. And this does come with the ultraviolet copy. And, and there you go. As you see, it's the only thing I have any problem with is. They make the cover kind of look 3D with the men in black with the different contrast changes so it looked like Agent J to give it a 3D feel when there actually isn't a 3D disc with this. So that's my only problem. But aside from that, I think this is a really nice Blu-ray. I did see this in the theaters. It far exceeded my expectations. You know, compared to the second men in black, that was just a piece of crap. But uh, they did really good with this. They put a lot of time into it. The story was excellent, you know, in the end, and you would you'd never see that coming. So you got Agent J right there. If you look close, you can make out his hair and his glasses and facial features. And you got Agent K right here on the back. Let's go ahead and get this open. And you have your, and your regular things from Sony and your ultraviolence. I have it for Pitbull, who I'm not a fan of at all. Now, I saw this on the European version, or HMV version. I'm not sure what this is on this. Like, it looks like, I guess it's a pie? Oh, it's it's a cake. I trust it's a cake from the movie. Okay. I look close and I realize what it is. If you haven't seen the movie, it's at the beginning of the movie again. It all makes sense to you. And then you have the DVD right here. So this artwork. Very nice job on the artwork. I can't remember the villain's name, but he's a badass. Let's just put it that way. Let's just go ahead and put these back in here. Put it in all the paperwork and that about does it and if you have any questions feel free to comment on the bottom and subscribe thanks for watching